As the project manager of a large technology implementation project, you are encountering conflicting stakeholder preferences regarding the project schedule. Some stakeholders are pushing for progressive elaborated schedule. In contrast, others are insisting on comprehensive schedule developed upfront. What should be your primary course of action to navigate these different views? Okay, so the project schedule is the problem area and the stakeholder conflict is pretty much visible. So how should you navigate where someone is asking, let make a detailed schedule and another people, uh, uh, another group is saying, why are we detailing everything? We can detail it as we go along. Yeah? So progressive elaboration, I should understand that they are saying we can plan it as we go along, try to plan everything in advance. So I'm a project manager in between, what should I do here? Option A, develop a schedule based on your organization's standard practices. You can say, I understand people will keep saying here and there, I follow what is my organization OPAs are. My organization has already told me that you are following a particular life cycle. I have done a project life cycle selection. I already have a template for it. I will just go ahead with that. Not a good idea. As a project manager, organization process assets are always important for us, but it is not something which is restrict our thinking. We should be open to think for our project benefits. We can challenge some of the existing templates and existing approaches. So I, I can't blindly follow my organization process assets. Yeah. So this particular option is just saying, you know, you ignore all these kind of challenges and you go ahead with what your organization standard process talks about it. Not at all a good idea. Option B, develop a comprehensive schedule, a uh, comprehensive detailed schedule initially and conduct a meeting to explain it. So it is saying that looks like it is something like a project manager preference is coming alive. So you think yeah, why you are doing option A. There are two stakeholders. One is saying, let's do it detail. Another person is saying, let's do it progressively. And you just decide to do in a one style and says, I will explain to these guys. So it means you have your own preference rather than looking at the stakeholder and you are going with a detailed scheduling uh, as, a, as an option. Though the question is not indicating the detailing is good or progressive elaboration is good. We don't know. Yeah, the question has, has no hint about it. So this is also looks like a forcing kind of conflict management technique that I will do in a particular way and I will explain to these people later. Yeah, So that's something is happening here. Let's see option C. Create a schedule with sufficient detailing for immediate activities and leave room for progressive elaboration for further task. So in a way, it is it is something like B. I am I'm inclining toward progressive elaboration, but I can say that rather than doing that, I'm doing sufficient detailing also. So it is like a middle path. I am finding a little compromised situation. I can say, okay, let's do a sufficient detailing uh, at least for something now. And for later on, we can keep progressively elaborating and we'll go like this. Yeah. So uh, again, could be an option, but this is, you are doing it uh, uh, on your own. You are not solving the conflict or you are making people, you are taking a compromised approach or you are focusing on a progressive elaboration approach without solving the problem. So to me, a, B, C, all are not good. So we only left with option D. Organize a brainstorming session. Good. If I just read this much, I'm done. Yeah. With all stakeholders to reach to reach a consensus on schedule management plan that suits the project's needs. So yes, I need to do collaborative way of working. If I'm looking from a conflict management perspective, collaboration is a good idea. Problem solving is a good idea. Let's bring everybody on the room and we discuss it. We can get the answer through that also. The another indicator is a schedule management plan. If I understand the utility of schedule management plan, the schedule management plan help us in having clarity about how are you going to take care of a project schedule? How much progressive elaboration we will do? What kind of units we will use? How much detailing we will do in our project schedule is something detailed in a project schedule management plan. So this, uh, this question can be answered by using any of these two paths. The one path is a conflict management path where I'm going for collaborative approach. Another path is understanding the term schedule management plan and you understand such kind of confusion should be resolved with the help of schedule management plan. So we got two indicators and option D looks great here. Now overall, this particular question is mapped to your plan and manage schedule. Yeah, that's something is, is there. This particular uh, process domain question, uh, task, task six, but this question is also uh, connected to people domain task because it is focusing on task one of people domain which is about manage conflict and this question is also touching the task 10 of people domain 
which focuses on that as a project manager, I need to build shared understanding in my stakeholder and the team. So I need to have a collaborative understanding. How are we doing together? Rather than I say, you, you, you may have a different understanding and other stakeholder may have a different understanding. So two people domain tasks are also getting touched here. Overall topic, it is primarily focusing on conflict management and a schedule management uh, uh, plan. Understanding of schedule management plan can also help you in answering this question.